What's up guys, it's FHB here and today I'm going to be showing y'all a really simple snare that you can build and I've gotten some comments saying that I should build something and I thought, and I've had this snare for a while and I thought, well, oh, it'd be great for me to just uh, show this snare and so uh, I came up, well, I came up with the design myself not that I created this snare because I know that other people have made it before but I had the idea and then I modified it into my own way where I could where it fit me best and so I'm going to teach you guys how to make it and I'm going to show you how it works let's get to it so here's the snare it's pretty simple so I drove these two sticks into the ground here and then this is the bait stick which had which is attached to this main cord with a another cord right here that goes off and then there's a uh, big uh, a big snare and you can tie that easy with a snare knot and in case you're new to making snares and uh, preferably probably shouldn't use neon cord um, I mean it's kind of obvious that it's I mean they're not squirrels aren't really gonna walk up to it and get it but this is the bait stick so you put like an apple or tomato you know banana something like that on here that or like a corn cob because I know that they make like squirrel feeder type things so you would put that on there and then you have the snare out and you might even want to like cover it up with some stuff so what happens is they come up and they sit there oh yeah also I uh, forgot this part this is a little stick that has a little notch coming out so it rests on there what they do is they come up and they put their paws on it and there's a rock up there that's tied on the string and so whenever they put their paws on it it releases the stick and remember they're down here and so they're uh, gonna have their paws on there pulls them up into the tree and so it keeps them out of way of like cougars you know something like that you know like other predators that try to eat them where as if they were on the ground they would probably get eaten all right next step is to take the stick that has a notch on it and you can uh, just take it and you know about how you want to make sure that your bait stick is comfortable with it so about that far would probably be good so what you're gonna do is it's quite simple really you just kind of nail it down into the ground so here's how it works so you're gonna have the uh, snare right there connected to there with your knot so thank you guys for watching and uh, I hope you enjoyed this video uh, please leave a like if you think we earned it please leave a comment for any more suggestions that you'd have and um, we'll be doing we'll be doing more videos uh, upcoming with fishing and hunting so and anything outdoors so I hope you guys enjoyed see you guys next time